Tis the season for porch pirates, you know, those pesky poachers of holiday packages. It's a problem the Lehigh Valley, like many areas, is grappling with. At WFMZ's Jackie Ferris is at the Allentown Police Department tonight with more. Jackie? Well, according to Shore Packaging, a nationwide packaging solutions company, roughly 30% of all packages that end up on doorsteps also end up being stolen. Now, one case here in Allentown was caught on camera just yesterday. Melissa Schneck says she's used to seeing kids walk through her Turner Street neighborhood every day after school, so she rarely thinks anything of it. But when the group ran, that's when... That's what caught my eye. Schneck checked her security camera footage, and this is what she saw. Here you can see they see the box, and they're trying to figure out who's going to take it. And uh, sure, it could have been a dare, but... It's not a very nice dare. Dare or not, law enforcement officials nationwide say these kinds of thefts jump during the holiday season. The alleged perpetrators are known as porch pirates, and there are ways to prevent them from stealing your loot. First, you can have your package delivered to your work or to a drop box like UPS Access Point. There are several in the Lehigh Valley. You can also require a signature so the package is not left unattended or have the package left with a neighbor. If a package is stolen, file a theft complaint with the carrier and call police. While security cameras won't guarantee a package won't be stolen, it will give police something to go on. Lastly, check to see if the credit card used to purchase the item has theft insurance. Some will cover your loss. As for the package pilfering on Turner Street, Schneck says the box was found open in an alley around the corner and some of the kids were identified after she posted the video to the Let's Build the New Allentown Together Facebook page. Because I want people to see what's going on, that if they're having packages delivered, this is what's going on. Schneck says she gave the video to the Allentown Police Department. We followed up with police officers who say they are looking into the matter. In Allentown, Jackie Ferris, 69 News.